with a more structured video than I've been doing lately. Honestly, kind of excited for it. I've been doing so many vlogs, but today I'm going to be dressing up as my favorite celebrities, or I guess more along the lines of like favorite female singers for the next five days. I'm very excited. I literally cleaned my room for this. The first artist is Madison Beer. I have some inspo pics of her, but if you didn't know, I went to her concert back in October and it was so Good. Let me just go ahead and tell you my favorite song of hers while we're on the topic. Madison Beer's album, Life Support. Literally, I listened to it for months nonstop. Okay, so Life Support came out in February and I went to her concert in October and I was still obsessed, so it's this cover. Okay, my three favorites. Probably Stained Glass, which I hated at first for some weird reason. Everything happens for a reason. I don't know if it's one of my favorites, but I love it. Everybody knows Selfish, and I love Good and Goodbye. I feel like Madison's street style is very like neutrals, basics. But on tour, I felt like she was more baby doll aesthetic with all the like ruffles and pastel colors. So I'm probably gonna go based off of her street style. You know, fit surrounding with that. <laughs> this is my crop top slash short drawer and it is so full okay i'm looking for like a very basic white crop top because she seems to wear that a lot when she's just like going for a stroll yeah i found these three white crop tops the first one a little thicker cute collar at the top that's an option i also have this one another basic white crop this one has like a cinch through the middle very cute and then we have this little white one with like some florals on it i didn't really see madison beer wearing florals when i was like researching her street wear we're all probably gonna say bye to this one oh i'll have to choose between these two as far as pants go i feel like she wears baggy jeans and I have this really cute pair of baggy cargo pants that I need to wear more often. So I think I'm gonna pull those out. They're so cute. This is shirt option number one with the pants. I actually really like this. I think I've worn this in a haul at some time, which is kind of funny. It's not super cropped, but I feel like it works enough. It still matches the vibe, I think. Mm, I like this one, but I feel like this shirt is not cropped enough. This is also like pretty thick. It is so hot right now. There's like a heat wave. For jewelry, I always see Madison like wearing big hoops. Sometimes they're silver, but I think most of the time she's going like with the gold jewelry and then she's like layering gold necklaces. So I think that's the vibe I'm gonna go with. the jewelry added some lip gloss because i feel like madison usually has a pretty like natural makeup look but this is the full look for today i'm gonna go put on some cute sneakers because she's usually wearing sneakers like she's kind of a sneaker head i'm not like at all so i'm just gonna wear the cutest pair of sneakers i have the artist for today is miss taylor swift Honestly, finding paparazzi pictures of her is really hard over the past like two years, I'd say. I found some from her like lover era. She's just very colorful and cute. I am kind of basing my outfit off of her a couple years ago. Just still her. It's still fine. The latest we know from Taylor is kind of like her Taylor's version of red era. So, which also was very like neutral tones. So I know exactly what outfit I'm going to wear today. Oh, I forgot to tell you some of my favorite songs of her. Also, plot twist, I got a haircut. I actually got like layers going down. It was kind of an experiment, but love, don't blame me. I love all 12 10 minutes is so iconic. Nothing new. Those are my most recent Taylor songs. I'm of course obsessed with everything she writes. So I'm actually combining the outfits that I found. In one picture, she's wearing this like yellow striped shirt and I literally have something so close to that. And then in the other picture, she's wearing black shorts 
I'm gonna combine the outfits, do my own little tailor combination. I don't even know if this is her current wardrobe. Oh, it's probably not. I couldn't really find that many streetwear pictures of her recently. So this is what we're going with. Okay, here's the final look. I don't know how Taylor Swift this is. I feel like this could definitely work for lover era just because of the yellow. Every single Bratzi picture Taylor Swift had sunglasses on, so I had to add these. Honestly, that's it. I feel like Taylor Swift streetwear is very classy and almost normal. Like, it's not like insanely out of the blue celebrity craziness. So, she always looks really cute and classic, which we love to see. Good morning. Oh, I don't know what video is coming out first. I think this one, but pretty much my hair is done from yesterday. I had a little senior photo shoot because I'm going to be a senior next year. But you'll see that in that video whenever that comes out. But it's Wednesday. Wednesday, June 22nd. Zoe's back there. In about 30 minutes, I'm leaving to go to my friend's house and we're gonna have like a pool day slash like going to get lunch. So I'm obviously going to be wearing like a bikini. But while I was doing my research, I saw that Tate McRae wears a lot of like super Super crop tops. I could wear a bikini and like it would kind of look the same. Let me show you. You're probably like, what is she talking about? Like you see how it's very cropped. Like that's like if I wear like a bikini top that could pass like something Tate would wear. Oh, I look so orange. But Tate also wears a lot of color. Like honestly, I don't have that much color. I feel like I'm a very neutral palette girl. <laughs> I don't own that much color. Not really sure why. Also jean shorts because I found a couple pictures of her wearing jean shorts. And that's the plan. Also I'm wearing my Madison beer merch today. <laughs> I'm just mixing up all the days. Oh, I didn't tell you what my favorite song of Tate was. Obviously her new album, I used to think I could fly, is actually my favorite art piece period at the moment. You're so cool. Top song for me right now. Zoe, don't leave. Zoe. My bed is not made up. Boy X, I love off her new album. Still say goodnight. You can just tell that it's like co-produced with Phineas. Like to me, it's so obvious. Don't come back. Sorry, they're just too many. Well, the whole album. Actually, just go listen to everything. I keep my bathing suits in this side of the drawer. So I'm just gonna like find a colorful top to wear. This has become my favorite bikini of the season and you've seen it a million times. I'm so sorry. I just keep wearing it. This top, actually obsessed with it. But I don't think I'm gonna pair it with the regular bottoms. I'm not gonna see these anyway because I'm gonna be wearing the jean shorts over it, but I'm just gonna wear these white bottoms with it today. Jean shorts. Found them. Okay, so this is the outfit, but I have to wear a shirt to go to the restaurant obviously and this is a colorful shirt that i have and i'm just gonna put some tennis shoes on she always has cool shoes but once again i'm not really a sneakerhead i'll probably be wearing these but in one of the pictures tate had like colored barrettes in her hair right here and i really want to go see if i have some and then we'll decide if it looks cute or not i feel like it might look a little weird this is my stash of barrettes i mean i don't really know if i have like super colored ones in here like she was wearing dump them out um, I have one. Ooh, this one's a pretty color. I think this is it, at least for like colorful ones. She put them all the way up here. Um, I don't know if this is the vibe. I'm not. <laughs> I mean, that's cuter. I don't feel like I look like Tate McRae. I don't know, y'all. I personally think they look kind of strange on me, but Tate knows how to pull them off. It's day four. I just got home from a run, so I'm gonna pick up my outfit and then go take a shower. But today I'm thinking we do Billy because today I'm pretty much lounging around the house. I have a few like work things to get done. I have to turn in a research paper essay, even though it's the summer. And I also have to finish editing a vlog. So I think I'm mostly gonna be lounging around. Billy's outfits are kind of perfect for that, I think. While I was looking around, I saw a lot of biker shorts and big shirts, which is perfect for the vibe today. My favorite Billy song out of all these people besides Taylor. I've been listening to Billy the longest, so picking a favorite song is almost impossible. I'd say Come Out and Play is one of my favorite songs. Getting Older. 
I mean, who doesn't love Happier Than Ever? And I hated so much on Haley's comment at first, and now I love it. Sorry. Okay, let's pick out an outfit. This shelf literally won't close anymore, so um, I think my biker shorts are at the top. These are the shorts. They have that cute little design on the back. And they're from Fabletics. I also have a matching bra. Like, I need to pick out a really big graphic t-shirt feeling. I've recently organized my t-shirt drawer. Let me give you a little tour. Over here's my random shirts. Don't really have a home. They're mostly college t-shirts. This is my ballet drawer. This is my band t-shirt stack. We have Conan Gray, Min I Trust, Tate, Wild Child, Taylor, Billy. And then this is my school stack. There's a bunch of random shirts down there. I'm gonna try and choose band t-shirt because that seems like most appropriate. Because I'm doing like singers. I don't know. I feel like you can't go wrong with the astronomy shirt. I feel like it's not big enough. What about Tate? I feel like Tate's big enough. I feel like they match like the navy and the pictures and the pink. Today, we are dressing up as Miss Olivia Rodrigo. Honestly, this is probably one of the ones that I'm most excited for. Olivia is very like grunge 2000s is how i would describe it she wears a lot of baggy pants a lot of doc martens sunglasses crop tops so a few days ago i got these jeans that i literally think are perfect for this outfit oh wait i gotta tell you my favorite songs the first favorite crime enough for you and brutal it's just so good her outfit in this is so cute okay ow these are the jeans I'm actually obsessed with them. I've shown all of my friends. I worn them once already. Pair that with obviously some sort of crop top. I don't know if I have a crop top that matches her exactly. Ah. I'm gonna look around in my closet for a second because I'm sure I have something that matches her style. I found this shirt, which I feel like is very Miss Olivia. I'm gonna take a shower and then change into that. I realized I never even put on the Billy outfit for the camera. It honestly wasn't that cute. I won't forget this time. <laughs> Here's the outfit. You can't really see the pants from this angle. I'll show you in the mirror. Just know that I'm packing for another really long trip, <laughs> so my room is not the cleanest just a little disclaimer before you see the mess everywhere i think this is probably one of my favorite outfits that i've worn out of this video it's actually really cute like i would wear this on a day-to-day -day basis i want to make this more olivia i'm gonna put on some combat boots and some jewelry and just spice it up a little bit Looking through her streetwear stuff, she's usually wearing like hoops and one necklace if she's wearing any jewelry at all. That's what we're gonna do. I have these little heart earrings that I literally love and then I have this daisy necklace that I kind of feel like matches her aesthetic. Maybe just a little bit, like the softer part of her aesthetic. There we go. I also want to put on some cool glasses or just like wear them on the top of my head because she always has on a fun pair of sunglasses or they're at least like around her. I don't know if she would be wearing these sunglasses, but at least there's something different, which I feel like her glasses are always very unique. There we go. Here's the full Miss Olivia Rodrigo outfit. It's on the crop top, the baggy pants, the combat boots, and the glasses. And that is everything. Thank you guys for watching this video. It was something a little more structured than what I've been doing lately, so maybe you enjoyed something out of the norm. I'll see you very soon.